So hi guys and um, welcome back to this week's vlog. Um, this week we're on the Alliday Trail Waterfall Country Walk in the beautiful South Wales. So I've been invited on this trip very kindly by ME Photographics, Martin, who's in the red there, and Joe Weaver, um, Joe Weaver Photography, who's in the black and blue there. So these guys, great guys, go and check them out on Instagram. I'll leave a couple of links um, up on the screen now. <clears throat> but as you can see by my foolishness, the mic didn't work when I was doing my intro. So that's why you're having a little voiceover one. So uh, we'll pick up the vlog as I head towards the little bridge just above the falls. And we'll, uh, we'll start the vlog from there. So I found this little composition here um, before I climb down to the guys. Um, the guys are just situated down there. I'll just zoom in for you. They're down there. So the shot I like is just off centre here. So I'm kind of looking at something like that. So I'm going to frame that up now. And uh, I'll take that shot, and if it's successful, you'll see it in a sec. Right, so first shot is set up here. I've got the camera nice and low. And we're looking at the falls, and they take you up to the bridge above. So that's the shot I'm taking. The light is just about showing now, so I'm in manual focus, ISO 100, F11, and I'm at sixth of a second at the minute. That shot is looking really good, which I'll put up now. So we are going to head to some other falls just downstream. Um, I'm going to take a few more compositions of this um, when the light decides to show itself. And I'll put those up now and then we'll make our way down to the other falls. see this waterfall is looking beautiful it is um, flowing a lot less I'm told Martin tell Martin's behind the camera he tells me that he's seeing this when it's been cascading all the way over the ledge 
um, but we're just going to work with what we've got today so so this is the shot we're looking at so as you can see we've got the ferns on the right the waterfall on the left and the rocks leading you through the center so that's what the camera's looking at and that's the ledge that martin said the water spills over so what i'm also doing is i'm taking a couple of shots polarized and unpolarized so this has got polarization on at the minute and if i turn it you can see all the reflections come back so i'm taking a couple of shots and then i'll pick which one i want to process when i get home so that's one of the many shots that i'm going to take from here i'm going to do a, a wide angle of it um, in landscape orientation um, and then i'm going to move around and just try and get a straight on shot in portrait and um, those two shots the landscape and the straight on i'll put up now So we've reached these middle falls. And that's the composition I'm shooting. So I'll put a 10 stop filter on. I'm trying to smooth out the water. And it's giving me some good good images. So this is the I think this is the second of the falls we're going up to the main the third one at the top and then there's one beyond apparently so we've got another three to do after this um, another two sorry after this but yeah it's um, so so far so good the rain's been coming and going um, but we're just working with it and we're uh, taking five having a coffee and that when we're when the rain comes so that's the falls and this is the image. horseshoe part of the, of the falls to just show you what we're looking at so this is what we're looking at now absolutely incredible that's the composition I'm looking at through the camera I'll put that shot on the screen now for you got Joe just behind me here taking a shot of what I was um, incredible so there's not much really <laughs> it's the rain's been on and off it's been battering us um, foggy lenses wet plots you name it we've just been battling the rain um, but yeah we're doing all right we've got had some decent shots so far um, so we're just going to continue taking shots of this here the lesson that I can only give today really is about polarisation um, 
using the polarizer just to give different effects. So I like to completely nullify the reflection um, and then I just dial it back in a little bit because I don't like it too flat. I do like a bit of reflection in the water so that's what I've been doing today um, as I showed you at the other falls when we were taking it in and out. That's all I've been doing really and just playing with exposure times. Um, but it's more of a guide this, more of a location view um, and a lesson because as the rain stopped now we're literally hitting it, taking a few shots and then we're moving on. As soon as we get our camera out it, it just pours down again. So we're just um, being opportunistic and firing away when we can. So um, when we reach the next falls, which is right up there, when we reach those falls, I'll get you back out again and we'll go through a composition up there. says we don't work hard for our shots, we bloody do. I'm just going to spin you out and show you where Joe is. So I've already been down here, uh, it is death. Um, I'll firstly show you. So we basically went down there. I don't know how we did it, well I did it first as a guinea pig, obviously. And then uh, Joe said, so what do you think mate, is it worth it? <laughs> yeah, it's worth it mate. So he's popped down and I've lowered all this gear down to him. So he is now set up down there. And he's basically taking the same shot that I did. Because obviously I'm the composition wizard, so... <laughs> I know you're watching this mate. So I've, um, I've allowed him to take my composition. So he's busy shooting away. And I'll put up that um, shot now that I took. This is the composition that I've got up here by the, by the third set of falls. So it's a bit of a strange one because it's all off centre. You've got the sky up there. So I'm putting the falls to the left, the other set of falls just to the right, just trying to balance it really. And then I've got all this, um, I've got this dead space here, but I'm hoping with a bit of polarisation I can bring out all these different shapes in the rock and that so that's my composition here and I'll show it now So we made it to the last waterfall on the trail. That's the composition I'm looking at. I may get some of this foliage on the right into shot. 
We've got Joe just out there in the middle. And Martin's way over there. We had to cross this river to get to this. And it is welly deep, so <laughs> wet feet, yep. Yeah. Right, I'll get this shot composed and then I'll show you what I'm looking at. So that's the composition we're looking at. I'll just take the shot now. And I'll pop that up for you now. So that's it from the uh, Waterfall Country vlog. So just like to say another massive thanks to Martin Evans, ME Photographics, put his link here, and to Joe Weaver, Joe Weaver Photography, again, I'll put his link here. Massive thanks to them for inviting me on this. It's been eventful, I think they would agree. Um, the rain's not been very kind to us, but in the short time that we've had to shoot, we've, I think we managed to get a few really good shots. So between us, we've got some crackers. So um, again, thank you very much to them. And thank you very much to you for watching again. Um, so if you haven't subscribed already, please do. It's a, a great help. And throw us a like and just comment and just tell me um, your experience on this trail. Um, and I am going to do the four waterfalls trail. It's another one further up the um, up the way i am going to do that at some point um, in spring next year so but until then thanks for watching and i'll see you next week mm -hmm.